While the heat is not only uncomfortable at times, it can be dangerous. So what are the best ways to cope with the high temperatures if you're going to spend time outdoors in the days ahead? WSAB's Tyler Carmona shares advice from the experts. The year's gotten off to a warm start. The first three months are the hottest such period ever recorded in Georgia. It isn't expected to slow down either. Climate scientists say this might be the hottest summer in 30 years in this state. The CDC says there's an average of 658 heat-related deaths per year. They also say each one of these deaths are preventable. Exposure to excessive heat can cause muscle cramps, dizziness, and lead to pre-existing health conditions flaring up. The most extreme consequence is a heat stroke. That happens when your body overheats to a temperature of 104 degrees or higher. According to the Mayo Clinic, some causes of a heat stroke include dehydration, alcohol consumption, and overly strenuous activity. Some symptoms of a heat stroke include high body temperature, altered mental state, and rapid breathing. The first sign of feeling your body kind of pushing over the edge, taking a break, and um, going inside, cooling off, staying inside in the middle, the heat peak parts of the day when it's the warmest, um, are some techniques we can use to take care of ourselves. Although the heat may be unbearable at times, getting sunlight under the right conditions is beneficial to your health. Reporting in Savannah, Tyler Carmona, WSAV News 3, on your side.